It is Friday Night SmackDown, and the WWE Universe is electric. We have one heck of a show in store for you here tonight. Sold out crowd, fired up locker room. It doesn't get much better than this, gentlemen. I've been waiting all day for a SmackDown, and now it's plenty of battles waged over the Intercontinental Championship over the years between legends and absolute titans of this business. This match could easily be history in the making. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Oh, misses the mark. Oh, strong impact. Boom, right to the jaw. Oh, you could pick up your teeth in section 112. Oh, what a counter. Oh, what a cutter. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Arms trapped. Here we go. And the con device is in. The official asking him, is he going to tap? Is he going to tap out? He's kneeing his way out. And he's free. Timing with that springboard. Wind him up. Boom. Knock him down. Ouch. Ricochet known for his speed and athleticism, but it's always size and strength that prove troublesome for him. That's usually an uphill battle for Ricochet, but he needs to depend on his innovative style. Suit his talents. That means keeping a quick pace. Ricochet is a moving target. A oh, double leg drop. Oh my God. Walter with good instincts there. Ooh, nice hip drop. Stop. Here's a pin for the title. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Dragon sleeper applied. Clever escape. Oh, he put the brakes on Ricochet. He avoids the damage. Solid punch. Oh, launching himself from the ropes. The hit's adding up a little on the champ. Great drop kick. Chop. Jumping knee strike. I like that. Stop in the leg. And that failed to hit the mark. And he's able to reverse. High flying, energetic, exhilarating. All described ricochet and so effective, man. Cover for the championship. Stopping the refs count at two. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Walter denies the attack. Great drop kick. Check out this, all the way down. Looking for the victory. Kicks out. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. Ooh, nice hip drop. Knife edge chop. Able to reverse that one. Ooh, DDT delivered. Top rope, boom, perfectly timed with the knees. Woo -wee. The challenger not looking good right now. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble. Oh boy. That number, power oh, bomb. bomb. Not done yet. Oh, not God. again, not again. A third time? Oh, come on, that's enough. Third time's a charm. Now that is why they're the champ. Cover! And a kick out. Simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if there'll be another shot, yet you can't give up now. How draining was that? Flying. Oh, what a counter, knees. That'll buy you some valuable time. And the electricity of this moment is...
Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. The heart of these competitors is showing through tonight. The adrenaline is coursing through their veins. Oh, what? Double chicken wing. The body's not supposed to bend that way. The effects of this match are showing on the champ. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. He steps foot in the ring again. Jarring impact. Ricochet, hand homage to his idol, The Rock. And The Rock never did it this pretty. People's moonsault. Great drop kick. Down across the neck. Turned around Ricochet's attack. The volume in this building has increased exponentially. The fans are willing these competitors to push forward. Win or lose, these superstars are going to be held in high esteem after this one. Hip drop. Ricochet is so evasive. The challenger's hopes are slipping away. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Boom! He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. What is he doing here? Oh no, get down from there. Get down from there, you don't have to do this. Walter sidesteps that. Great counter by Ricochet. Caught with a punch. Oh, he's setting him up. Oh no, this is this is gonna be bad. Guys, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Dangerous part of town on top of the table. The table is scattered in pieces. What a mess. Listen to this place. Ah, oh, jumping cutter. And Ricochet brings the fight back to his opponent. Now this is unfamiliar territory for the big Austrian. Punch right in the head. Returning to the ring now. Oh, costly error there. Up and down. Oh. Oh. Not done yet. Uh -oh. Again? Uh -oh. Wow. Enough's enough. A championship level move. Pin. The champion retains. Let's take another look at these guys in action. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Walter! You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory. There's the consequences of getting caught unprepared. It's gonna be tough for this superstar to overcome the numbers tonight as they face two competitors. Well, it won't be easy, but nothing makes a statement like overcoming the odds and winning in a handicap match situation. Ooh. What a counter! Big splash! He's one step ahead there. Short jab. It's raining down those shots to the back of the neck. Clubbing blows. He's tagging out. Counters. This could be an opportunity. 
Byron, we talk about the importance of strategy. What can you tell us about creating a game plan for a matchup like this? If you're on the wrong end of the numbers game, a superstar must find a way to limit the options of the other team. Try and eliminate some of your competition. Now, which is why the outnumbered superstar can't waste any time going on the attack. Dunn is out of the way. Able to capitalize on McIntyre's mistake. And another counter. Evades their offense. And it's McIntyre that goes for the ride. Spin kick to the midsection. He had it scouted. And a kick. Dunn turns that around. Whoa, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. The referee continues the count, may call it soon. Power bomb. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. He's going for it all. Cha-ching! Step up in Zaguri. Tag is made. Ooh! Turning the tables there! And responds with a counter of their own. Reversal on top of reversal. There's some power behind that punch. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. Down with a power bomb. Is it enough? Gets the shoulder up after one. Doesn't go well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. Wow, belly to belly. He's been placed in the corner now. McIntyre getting ready. Incoming. Diving into the leg drop. Goes into the pin. Oh, that was just malicious. Power bomb dropped him. Oh, McIntyre holding him at bay. Insulting. He could pin his opponent right here. Able to stop the pin count here. Kick to the gut. Oh, brutal forearm. Come on, count along if you want. The 10 beats of the Bodron. Shot after shot after shot. Good grief. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. Claymore, good night. Dunn took all of that move. Kick to the gut. Oh, brutal forearm. Pete Dunn is getting dismantled. Yeah, Dunn's in a spot of trouble. McIntyre gets met with a response. Great wherewithal on the counter. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Being carried around with ease. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. to reverse German suplex but that's not all into a ripcord lariat what a combination this could spell doom for McIntyre and 
Indy's able to counter. Quick exchange of counters there. Play more! McIntyre might have him. Raped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm! As this match goes on, is there any self-doubt running through the minds of these competitors? You can't even allow that notion to creep into your head. You have come too far and fought too hard to grow weak now. These two showing how well scouted they each are. Got to find a way to get out of this. Oh, right to the throat. Boom! <laughs> From the top, look out below! Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. Ooh. Mounted with punches and not oh a nasty stomp to finish it off. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. That'll stop the count. And this match will continue. I'm glad that wasn't the end of things. Strong suplex. He's looking shaky at best now. This is a very dangerous situation now. Tag is made, and here we go. Oh! Shoulders down. And he only stays down for a one count. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't either. Can this ref even count to three? Oh, foot just stomping down. There are no words for the ride these fans. Take off. He misses the target. Short flight, but a rough landing. Look out! That's mounted with punches and not... Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh, right to the gut. What's he gonna do here? The foot DDT! And this might not have a pleasant ending. Oh! Driven face first into the apron. Oh, man. McIntyre with an incredibly ruthless sequence. Next level brutality coming from McIntyre. Everyone get out of the way. These two are abandoning all restraints. Drew McIntyre is bleeding profusely now. Done with a great counter. He has got something destructive in his mind. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. Action needs to return to the ring and fast. And he's adamantly in control. Just a steady dose of punishment on display. All right, sliding back in. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. Oh, he had the wherewithal to counter McIntyre. Arm ringer applied. Arm ringer finger snap. Ooh, bent in a sickening way. With the counter. Claymore! And Dunn takes on further damage with that one. Yeah, this Jump lengthy match has certainly had a cost on Dunn. 
The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Was mounted with punches and not. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. He turns it around. Good grief. That's a chop that'll wake you up. Good timing with that reversal. Tough position to be caught in here. Check your face after that one. Oh! Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm! Done with a great counter. Snap suplex! Very nice. And the hits to the core keep coming. The bruiser weight bringing the victim into view. Can he take advantage? And just like that, he said, crashing to the floor. Feed off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Now would be the time for everyone. He shoves him onto the announce table, looking to end this in spectacular fashion. Hoist it up, oh my gosh. Oh, through the table. I'm in shock. What a disaster. He slides back into the ring. Boom! Claymore delivered. Going to the well again. Will it produce dividends? Job scene done coming. Ooh, running knee strike. From the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. Great awareness from Dunn. The Bruiserway at the mercy of his opponent. McIntyre setting up. That might be all Drew needs. That's gotta be it. Two. Oh, he was almost finished. What a kick out. Pete Dunne's toughness is on display tonight. McIntyre won't lose focus, though. He's got... And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Expertly applied triangle. Drew McIntyre is in a bad way. The Scottish psychopath could be the Scottish... Able to free himself of the triangle. Gun turns that around. Whoa, oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. A oh, straight form. Does he get him here? And only gets a one count. I am shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. Dunn had that scouted. Kick to the gut. Ooh, brutal forearm. Wow, belly to belly. Great counter, impressive ring IQ on display there. Dunn takes him up and down. For the pin and the win. Yes! How in the world? Incredible resiliency. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. Oh, Mr. Dunn's opponent is about to meet. Bitter end! Drew with cause for concern. Cover! Two! It's over! It is over! We've got some time to take another look at some of the highlights from that one.
Holland, and Pete Dunn. Wow, just wow. A tremendous win in this match. They are riding high on this win. This celebration might carry on the rest of the month. It's always exciting to watch Xavier Woods in the ring, a superstar with a seemingly endless supply of creative energy. Yeah, whether it's dreaming up innovative new moves or wacky new gear, Woods is always thinking outside the box. The way he keeps refreshing his in-ring style can make him pretty tough to keep up with. And I bet Xavier can easily imagine himself picking up the win here tonight. I can't wait to see what he's cooked up for us in this one. Then you have a battle-tested Viking warrior in Eric. He's plundered his share of tag team gold, but now he's out on his own, eager to prove he's just as intimidating. Don't be foolish in doubting Eric's power. He's more than ready to show us what a real Viking can do in the ring. Saw that one coming. Oh my, oh my, what elevation. Woods, way up top. Sky high. Oh, and he doesn't connect. So much damage inflicted. From your perspective, Corey, what's the X factor that Xavier Woods brings to this match that could help push him to victory? I'd have to go with Xavier's willingness to deliver a 200% effort in the ring. Woods doesn't have a single ounce of quit in him. He goes all out and fights for the win every time. If he shows that same level of commitment and resilience here tonight, victory could be his. The arm absorbing the damage. And Eric's power being curbed with that attack. Woods creating an opportunity to attack there. Whipped over in a snap suplex. Oh, barbaric amount of stomps. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He's reeling, slowly getting up. Look at the athleticism of the tightrope drop kick. I think it's time to make. And able to beat Woods to the punch. Measuring his opponent. Oh, this could be over. And that attack proves Eric is just as intimidating. He's got Woods in his grasp. A oh, death row by Eric. Does Woods have anything left Makes in him? the cover. Oh, he gets the shoulder up before three. I would have bet this was one after that last hit. Goes to show you just never know what your opponent's capable of. Everything possible was done to win there, but it just fell short. Taking out the arm, great strategy. Launching. Splash! Is it enough? The cover! A defiant kick out after one. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. And Eric with the counter. And Woods saw it coming. I can't believe what I'm seeing. I thought this superstar was finished. Now they're in control. Yeah, apparently not. Never underestimate what this superstar is capable of. Not oh, target of the arm. Makes him pay with a counter. Bad predicament right here. Down on the windpipe. Stomping. Ouch. Ooh. That hurt. And there's the cover. Kicks out. He still has life. So, so close. That could have been it. And finds a counter. This could be big. Going up high. Oh my gosh. Will Xavier put it away here? Two count. Three. No. A two count. He's taking some serious hurt, but somehow he's still in this. I think he managed that kick out on pure instinct alone. And you got to think that all the plans are out the window after that. What a battle we are witnessing. We're at a stage where someone's going to have to shift it into another gear. Belly to back suplex. No! Oh, oh, belly to back suplex with the penalty kick. Try to end it. Three! No, no, no! The shoulders were not down. The referee was right on top of it. 
These superstars have toiled away endlessly, and this crowd is on their feet in full appreciation. An incredible sight to see. Eric gets countered. Oh, elbow smash. What a match. What a match. The stomp in every single part of his body. Forearm to the jump. Powerless position to be in right now. Piercing the throat. Will it be? I think so. And picks up a monumental victory. That had to be one of the matches of the year. Let's take another look at some of the action. Gotta hand it to our winner, standing tall with their arm raised tonight. You can tell this guy was fired up from the moment the bell rang.